Hello. Yeah. On this second video, I'm going to talk a little bit about my uh, nine uh, courses. Uh, I have them here in the written form, but you can also read them, read about them on our uh, website. Uh, first of all, I would like to tell you that uh, my method uh, of teaching is one-on-one, uh, -on -one, which means that I will be your mentor. This also means that we are going to have frequent communication with each other and uh, frequent, uh, we will frequently uh, uh, mail each other, uh, often on a daily basis. We will also make other ways of communications uh, uh, between us uh, because uh, I want you to feel sure and confident about your path. So, uh, the first course is about making the first step to divine providence by evoking 30 cats of the earth zone. There are, 36, uh, 300, there are 360 cats of the earth zone, but we are going to evoke uh, 30 of them. We need to identify them first. And uh, they uh, should match your uh, life uh, path, your life situation, your life aspiration, your jobs, professions, maybe hobbies. So uh, first of all, we are going to identify them and then uh, I will give you instructions about the po best possible ways how to evoke them and, what, and how to keep on communication with them in the future. The second course will be uh, about meeting your guardian angel. There will be actually two guardian angels and uh, they will come from this great uh, angelic order of uh, Shekha Forosh angels. Uh, uh, those angels, uh, there are 72 of them. They can be helpful in many things. They are great uh, uh, masters of uh, mercurial ma magic. Uh, they are the great uh, messengers from God. And uh, between many other things, uh, they can also become uh, our guardian angels uh, if we want to. And uh, this is what uh, we are uh, going to do in this course. The third course is uh, uh, again about the Shekha Forosh Angels, but it is more advanced. It is, uh, and it will also last uh, uh, longer. Uh, this is about making the third step of the Divine Providence by becoming the number 73 as the Shem ambas Ambassador on Earth. So during those three uh, evocations of, 300, uh, of 336 Shekha Forosh Angels, uh, you will be uh, in a position uh, to uh, master Shem magic. And also, uh, at one moment, uh, one of them will come to announce you that they, they would like you to uh, join their company by pronouncing you their ambassador on the earth. So you will get uh, this number 73. To be the Shem ambassador on the earth is a great honor and a great responsibility, of course. So. The fourth course is about making the second step to divine providence by traveling to the moon and becoming, uh, becoming lunar magician. Here we are going to evoke uh, 14 of uh, 28 uh, uh, lunar uh, spirits who are the guardians of 28 uh, lunar mansions. The fifth course is about the meeting the great spirit of Taro through uh, Taro magic uh, here in this course. What we're going to do is to evoke uh, uh, each of the 22 great spirits who are the guardians of 22 uh, greater arcana tarot cards. And uh, what we're also going to do is uh, to uh, um, enter though each of those 22 cards to see uh, to, 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 uh, and this we can do, we'll, we are going to be able to do through astral magic, through our astral projection, through our mental projection, or at least through lucid dreaming. And at one moment uh, uh, of our, uh, during our course, uh, the great uh, spirit of Tarot will also come from your Tarot, your personal great spirit of Tarot will come uh, 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 to you to give you a gift and uh, after that moment uh, uh, you will uh, be in a position to expect a great improvement uh, 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 as a tarot reader and in tarot magic uh, in general. Our sixth course is about meeting the 10th archangels and traveling through the tree of life. Uh, 
the initiation is here given by uh, uh, the Ar Archangel uh, Sandalphon on Malkuth. Uh, and uh, after that, you'll be in a position to uh, visit uh, uh, all other uh, Sephiroth from the Tree of Life. These experiences are really great, fantastic, very magical, and they are as real as this world could be. Our eighth course is about making the fourth step to divine providence by becoming a friend with Venus. Here, we will maybe not be so much ambitious, but what we are going to do is to evoke two uh, genie from uh, the Venus zone. And uh, we'll make it sure that those experiences will be great, very beneficial, very spiritual. We will learn a lot about Venus magic, about Venus tradition, and uh, this is really a great journey. However, if you uh, really uh, want to make it sure that this uh, will uh, work in a most positive way, uh, you will uh, need uh, to be advanced uh, in your evocations, which means that you need to have already had some experiences with evocations with uh, uh, cats from the from the earth zone and uh, from the uh, moon zone and uh, uh, with uh, Sheka Forest Angels. And the final course is uh, my ninth course. It is about mastering the 30 atrius of Enochian magic. Uh, here, uh, we, what we're going to do is uh, to uh, progress through the system of atrius uh, from the uh, last uh, 30 one, which is called the Tex, to the most advanced one, which is called Lil. Usually, this uh, path takes many, many years to fulfill, but I'm confident about that you and me can do it in uh, one year. So, uh, at the end, uh, I would like to tell that uh, uh, for me, it, it has taken few decades to, um, to, 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 to stand here before you and to tell you, yes, I'm very confident that I can teach you about uh, uh, those uh, magical topics I was talking about. So it took me several decades, but for you, uh, it can take uh, uh, less time, much less time. And uh, uh, I, it would be my honor to help you, to help you to do it uh, uh, the best you can and uh, uh, as fast as possible. Okay, have a good day. Bye-bye.